Hello, this is Ross Marquand, and I'm with Top Level Media. Have a good day. This is Chris with Top Level Media, and I'm here with... Ross Marquand. Okay, Ross. How are you enjoying to, uh, Comic-Con here in Pensacola? I love it. I was here four years ago, and uh, I'm, I'm happy this time I actually got to have a little more time to check it out because I was working like crazy, and I had to go back to the hotel room uh, every night last time and read scripts. So this time I'm finally able to relax and sit in President's Day weekend, so I actually get to enjoy myself more, so it's great. Right. A lot of the question that your fans ask is, um, how did you first get into acting and for The Walking Dead? It, it was Boy Scouts and church. I was doing a lot of campfire ceremonies. I did like plays in church, and then I just started going from there. And then I got a BFA in theater, at the University of Colorado, and then uh, moved to LA. And I got I auditioned three times for The Walking Dead, and then the third time it worked out. So the rest is history. Yeah. Right. So, what is your like favorite episode of Walking Dead? Uh, the Grove by far, season four, the Look at the Flowers episode. It's in my opinion, it's the best episode by far. Yeah. How did you get ready for Walking Dead? What did you do to, uh, you know, get prepared? Um, well, I read the a lot of the comics because when I got the part, I asked Scott Gamble if I was we were trying to do like an exact copy of what we see from Aaron in the comics, and he was like, "No, read it, of course, because Kirkman does an incredible job of laying out who these characters are and everything." But he really wanted us to make it our own too, and so we, uh, Jordan Woods Robinson and I, who played Eric, we like studied this comic like crazy and then we sort of met and did some backstory of our own for who they were and that really helped a lot so right do you think walking dead will make a return sometime or? oh yeah i mean there's it's, it's gonna be like the new star trek there's gonna be three or four spin-offs as soon as we wrap and it's gonna go on for years you can't kill a zombie you know yeah, yeah. right exactly so my last question is what would you say to inspiring actors uh that are upcoming trying to get into the business i would just say don't be afraid to get your stuff out there do do i used to do YouTube all the time like that's that's really where I got a lot of my agents a lot of opportunities was just by doing videos for myself and I think you got to not be afraid of having bad commentary or bad feedback or whatever just the worst thing you can do is not try so just put the stuff out there and then let everyone decide if they like it or not you know right yeah. right well thank you very much my for pleasure, this time yeah. thank you